All right, Nick, I understand you have a very interesting demonstration of this cooling technology. So we've been demonstrating the, the heat pipe concept uh, to people. Actually, heat pipes is a very common cooling device that's been around for close to 50 years in a commercial market. It was invented in like the 1840s, was then called the Perkin tubes. But then uh, Los Alamos actually improved it big time in the 60s, and one of the first applications of the heat pipes was for uh, the space program, notably the Apollo program, after which uh, that rack also references to. Okay. So the heat pipe, as we showed on the three earlier in the rack, basically moves, collects the heat on the processor side, moves that over to the, the dry disconnect portion. So how efficient is that at transferring heat? So okay. transferring heat. What we have here is a solid copper rod, quarter inch, and you would think that copper is the best heat conductor, right? Yep, yep. That's why the chefs use copper in their pans for cooking. For, for even heating, that's the best thing. Because right? it's the best heat conductive material, yeah. right? And that's a heat pipe. So let's try it out for me. You're gonna okay. hold them like that, Okay. and tell me which one gets the hottest first. You okay. probably wanna hold them from higher than that. Really? Help you out. Am I gonna get burned here? Yeah. Okay, so the pointy one is the heat pipe. And I'm putting it in the hot water, and the pointy heat pipe one is hot like almost instantly. In fact, I have to let go. Uh, right, let whoa. it go. Don't. And the other one, I didn't feel any heat at all. All right, good. So when it cools down, you get to keep it. Yep. And uh, you uh, you can have it and basically uh, show your friends. It also works. I can show. You don't have to do it with with hot water. You can yeah. do it with cold drinks as well. And okay. It conducts. So the like cold. a like a cold beer maybe. Uh, yeah. Or a margarita. A margarita. Oh, so, okay. 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 Yeah. I'll, okay. I'll, I'll yeah. Cool if a drink stare at that. All right. right. Well, I can relate to that. So that's I'll good. give you a cold one. You get to keep it. All, All right. right. Okay. Right. And that's the technology you're using in here to get the heat out to these uh, sidebars exactly. and then let the water take that away. Exactly. Got and it. We also have a bunch of those under that plate here yep. that basically conducts the heat from the memory. The yep. memory is a very simple dim, yep. uh, dim with an aluminum jacket on it to help for the heat conduction. Yep. That travels to those heat pipes and then those heat pipes will dump the heat into those two top heat yeah, pipes, yeah. then goes out. And it was amazing. It was instantaneous almost that I, I felt that heat uh, on top of that pipe. So uh, so that's basically the whole cooling magic we do in Apollo. And then as looking at the tray, what you see is that we have probably one of the smallest InfiniBend Nick that was ever built, mm -hmm. uh, working with Mellanox. Uh, then you have everything is basically built in. That's a, You see the two servers. Uh, we're going to eventually, we're... There's also versions with accelerators we're working on. Uh, you get the whole nine yards. It's a true HPC platform.